Hello everybody, I'm going to present you today how to make an electromagnet at home. Very easy and very different. Normally, if you're going to search, they wrap around some wire, around a metal rod, and that's it. But for <coughs> the project of today, we're going to need a washing machine pump. You can find it everywhere, they are kind of cheap. Or if you can find a washing machine on the side of the road, take it and there are lots of interesting stuff inside it that you can reuse all right so for this project we're gonna need the washing machine pump it looks like this normally it's got a motor a magnet that fits inside here but we discarded it all we have to do is remove this plastic thingy and then we're gonna connect to a battery so let's proceed with the let's see if it's gonna be easy I'm guessing this one maybe. Alright. Let's see. Maybe it's got something else. What could hold this stuff in? Very easily not to damage the wires. We can try to be as gentle as we can. Alright. Well, that was easy enough. Here you go folks. This is it, your electromagnet thingy. Hmm, looks nice. Maybe we're gonna make some other project with it. Who knows? All right, let's see. We're gonna need a nine volt battery, a screwdriver or something metal, and let's see if we're gonna connect the wires to the battery. Something happens. Maybe the battery is shit. Let's try another one. Biggie. See? Oh ho! Oh! And look, friends. Ah, it was like nearly permanent magnet. Nearly. Let's try it once again. Hoo -hoo. Can you hear it? Mm -hmm. was close was close close enough but I'm gonna show you some interesting stuff as well stay tuned all right folks so I'm gonna present you now a very interesting experiment we're gonna straighten these wires like so to be able to stand up we have another washing machine motor pump that we're gonna put it on top of the, the, the one that we managed to remove the plastic thingy. But first of all, we're gonna connect the wires from the driving washing machine pump to the receiving electromagnet thingy. Let's see if it's that powerful, folks. Let's see. All right, we have managed to twist the wires. We put it on top, yeah, on top of it, and now we're gonna take it a small spin. Whoa, here we go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So, oh, uh -huh, it's got plenty of power, man. Let's see once again. Here we go. No trickery, no things, wires here. Here you go. It's holding, so it's got some. Pretty power. Look, it's got power, friends. <laughs> Maybe this is similar to lead scaling experiments. Never know. I think I saw this one somewhere, but yes, pretty interesting shit. How about it? Let's just remove it. Ah, very easy. Once again, fucking amazement. <laughs> yes. Yes. So there you have it, folks. How to make an electromagnet at home very easy very simple you can show to your science class to your roommate to your colleagues to your friends pretty interesting and pretty stiff as well yeah and now to remove the electromagnetic effect just twist it in the other way here you go yeah <laughs> fucking hell man yeah this is interesting this is interesting and I'm feeling this one is gonna have some real 
interesting projects. Yeah, soon enough, friends. All right, this was it. Thanks all for watching. Check out my other videos, how to make a washing machine motor generator or how to dismantle it, how to wire the wires and some other stuff down below. If you got any comments, you got my email address, you got my Instagram, Twitter, I'm everywhere, friends. Everywhere, all over the place. Thanks all for watching. In the meanwhile, thumbs up, subscribe, share this video and see you on the next one. Woohoo, yeah, holding like a champ. <laughs> no skills required.